Hello everyone, this is Denise with Poulter Real Estate and today I'm going to show you how I cut up a watermelon. Um, first you have to start with a watermelon. So I give a big shout out to Mr. Cuevas at JMR Farms. He always says to find one that's got a spot on it and you're spot on with your watermelon. So today um, you're going to need a cutting board, a knife, I prefer one that's got the sharper edge to it and then a bowl obviously to put your watermelon in. I first start off by cutting off the ends. You got to put some muscle into it, kind of work it around a little bit and get your ends off. Now my dog Tico likes watermelon so at this point he might go a little crazy because usually I'll give him the end of a watermelon so he can start licking it. My dog's a licker. So I cut off both ends of the watermelon. I lay it on the side like this. And now I'm gonna start carving off the sides of the watermelon. We'll get those sides off. Again, a good big sharp knife will help with this and I kind of work around it the rounded edge here those of these all right Tico there you go likes to lick the watermelon put them in there and I keep moving the watermelon around we're almost there, folks. My family loves watermelon. My husband's a mailman, so on hot days, he likes to come home and have watermelon. My granddaughter loves the watermelon. Grandson. Who doesn't like watermelon? So, this is what it's going to look like once you get all of the rind off of it. And then I just cut down. Depends on how big you want your chunks. Sometimes I like to do them small. Sometimes I'll even make like strips, watermelon strips. This actually is a seedless watermelon, which I prefer. This way. And then you just cut them down to the size that you like. Like I said, sometimes I'll leave them in strips, bigger strips, so you can just eat them with your fingers. It just depends if you're doing a fruit salad, you probably want them a little smaller. So, but that's how I cut a watermelon. Have a great day, and if there's anything I can help you with as far as selling or buying a home, get a hold of me at Poultry Real Estate.